G'day everyone, Jeremy Buckingham here. I'm at Weir 32 on the Darling River near Manimdi, near Broken Hill in western New South Wales. I'm with Darren Clifton. Uh, he's a community campaigner who's started a group, We Want Action, on the management of the Manimdi Lakes. We're out here having a look at this weir, uh, the management of the Darling River and the Manimdi Lake system. There's a con community around Broken Hill and Manimdi is very concerned about what the state government and the Murray-Darling Basin has been doing in terms of management, and I'd say mismanagement of this system. So, uh, what do you think the issues are, Darren, and what should be done about it? So, firstly, the, the Murray-Darling Basin Authority draws down a lot of water. That's um, uh, an immense, immense quantity and leaves zero water upstream. And now we're down below the 480 gigalitre mark, which puts broken hill below its 18 month water supply. Uh, Rather than do massive drawdowns, they need to change the management of the lakes and the river system and draw down on a gradual basis, leave water upstream from Menindi and the more water from Broken Hill. At this stage, Menindi is suffering um, immensely because of the downturn in tourism, it affects their economy, it affects the, the, the plight of the people, and we need to have that system changed. Kevin Humphreys, um, New South Wales Water Minister, wants to put Broken Hill on the emergency water supply. This very spot here is one of our suggestions where we can raise this weir by two metres and feed the water back towards the Indy and have it as a surface water emergency water supply. We don't need bore water to We never need a bore water. And the bore water, the community is opposed to it, it's poor quality, and you believe that there's uh, alternatives like raising the weir, extending a few pipelines, changing the management of the lakes. Most definitely, and Kevin Humphreys hasn't come to the table to discuss the full options of that. He's got our, our first two options, but we could build on those options. He needs to sit down with the community and really listen to what we want. Politicians need to listen to their community members, otherwise they won't be voting the rest of the Yeah, thanks Darren. It's a really important issue. I'll be raising this in the Parliament, uh, learning about the management of this system, the lakes, the river, etc. So I'll be raising the issues, what I've learnt today from Darren, people in Menindee, people in Sunset Strip and Broken Hill. I'll be raising that in the Parliament and holding the National Party to account, making sure that they are held to account for their poor management of the system and making sure there's a debate in Parliament about how we can do it better. Infrastructure spending, looking at how we manage the system better. I'll be raising it in Parliament. Really appreciate your time in there. Thank you very much, Thanks, mate.